Here's your WNEM TV5 news update. Good morning, everyone. I'm Colette Stinger. Here's a look at the top stories we're following today. The Flint City Council has once again delayed a vote on a $300 credit on residents' water bills. In a unanimous vote, the council sent the resolution back to committee to refine the parameters for the credit. Concerns came up after a representative from the water department stated that even with the credit, residents who had not paid their bills since June 31st of 2021 would still have their water shut off. Well, Consumers Energy will be replacing a power pole in Midland near its Sturgeon substation on Saginaw Road. This work will require a temporary power outage for residents in some of the neighborhoods served by this substation. This will primarily affect residents located between Wackerly Street and Saginaw Road from Dublin Avenue to Sturgeon Avenue. The outage is expected to begin around 9 a.m. and may last until 3 p.m. Well, if you're looking to get your kids caught up on their vaccines, Molina Healthcare is here to help. They will join the Bay County Health Department to get kids up to date on vaccinations before the start of school. It's the kindergarten roundup. It will offer vaccines, lead testing, and hearing and vision screenings. Molina will also offer prizes and free snow cones for the kids. That event is at the Bay County Health Department today from 3 until 6. Now here's Matthew with a look at your forecast. Thank you, Colette. One thing you'll notice for this Tuesday is the lower humidity. We already have that this morning feeling very pleasant and our temperatures very pleasant for today too. lower 70s across the thumb, but middle to upper 70s. The farther away you are from Lake Huron, that's due to a northerly wind today. But your first one five sky tracker is high pressure moving in, so that's what keeps the quiet weather for our area. Just a few clouds though that linger across the thumb could provide just some spotty showers there close to noon, but that chance does appear to be pretty low, but overall expecting decreasing clouds today and a mostly sunny finish to the daytime. Overnight we'll have clear skies, some patchy fog possible by Wednesday morning, but then your Wednesday, another mostly sunny day, a little bit warmer Wednesday than we are today, and we'll look for a cold front to move through in the evening that primarily just looks to bring a few clouds in, not really expecting too much rainfall out of that cold front. Something to just keep some tabs on for Wednesday evening, but no need to camp cancel any plans. Thursday and Friday are looking dry and then we do have some shower chances returning Sunday into Monday but for the remainder of this work week going to be pretty nice and pretty comfortable. So get out there and enjoy it. Remember to tune into WNEM TV 5 on air and online 24 seven for the latest news, weather and information.